So a lot of friends have been asking me what beeswax wraps are. And it's basically a piece of cloth that has melted wax on it. And um, some of them have just regular wax, beeswax melted onto it like this one. And some of them have jojoba oil on them as, long, um, as well as beeswax. I am actually going to be making my wraps with jojoba oil from now on so that they don't get these little crumbly spots and the lines and creases as easily. That way the life of your beeswax lasts longer and you don't have to season it as often. Because without the jojoba oil in it, it will crease like this and you'll have to season it more often. So you want this to go longer, obviously, without having to reseason it. So you have less to do um, with caretaking of this product. So this is the sandwich wrap fold that I've made. And I have fruit snacks in here. And I just crudely folded this together this morning because we were in a hurry. And I feel like this is actually a really good way of showing you that they don't have to be perfect. They don't have to be the exact perfect measurements. So if you do these yourself at home, whoops, I'm trying to open it wrong. See, look at how much easier that was rather than me trying to open it from there where there's clearly nothing. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so the sandwich wraps and then you just fold them down like this and they make a seal with your hands. Obviously, I'm doing this one-handed. It's not as easily. But yeah, you just make a little seal. Pinch it down. And you can even make little cups. Like, they'll stand up if you want them to. This one really isn't a cup, but it'll still stand up. Um, and then you just unfold it when you're ready. Don't get these super moist. Like, don't put stuff in here that is moist and... Um, like salad dressings or anything like that. I wouldn't recommend doing that, obviously. But for my fruit snacks, it's great. They're nice. Nice and nice and tasty. They don't taste like the beeswax or anything like that. They taste nice and fresh. We put these in here this morning. You could even um, buy things in bulk this way and just put them in a little cup and then have your... Number ready to go when the cashier weighs it. But I think I'd probably do something a little different than that. But yeah, this is a beeswax wrap. It's not as pretty as some of the future ones I'll be making, but it definitely works, and I definitely like it. Beeswax wrap, everybody. Alright, I'm done with that now. I'm going to fold that back up, stick it back in my cupboard. Ta-da! Ain't nothing coming out of that beeswax wrap.